you should do what you feel uh, is right. So don't try to follow any structures. For example, people are telling you to, you know, work eight hours and just quit everything and relax for the next eight hours. Um, I think you should do what feels right right for you. And uh, if you actually do enjoy working for for long periods of time and you feel like you're being very very fulfilled what you're doing, then uh, Right, go ahead, just try not to burn yourself out and be sure that what you're doing is actually what you like to do. The excitement, the belief, uh, the faith about technology that really connect us all together. And I think that is just something super, super beautiful, right? Because it's, um, me and my friend constantly talk about how people have built something. And, you know, for example, Professor McCauley, he has designed this whole ecosystem, right? And it, people one by one passing the torch onto the next generation or onto other people uh, which i think that's something so exciting to me about the whole industry there's nothing that limits you it's only you and your thoughts and your mind that's limiting yourself you can do whatever you like you can improve as much as you like and uh, don't think that something will be a roof to your improvement you can't go further than a line or you don't have limits I don't think uh, that blockchain and crypto is only about financial markets. It's not only about trading. It's a revolution and um, it um, helps to omit centralized powers. It's here to give you more freedom. It helps you to uh, be your own bank. On the journey of fulfillment or bring much value into the community or into this world, there are always the good things or the quote unquote the bad things were the challenges. But in the end of the day, I truly believe that the challenges are just here for a reason that maybe I don't realize why some challenges are here in this moment, but maybe a few months later or a year later, or maybe even a few years later, I can look back and I will know exactly why I went through what I went through and most of the time I was so happy because the person I have become